children are the centre of everything that we do here. So as part of the school, as part of Kalu and Oshk, they are our main priority. And that's why it's important that those partnerships exist, not only between Oshk and the school, but between Oshk and the individual teachers, between the school, Oshk and the families, and between any other specialists that happen to come into that equation as well. So I would see the OSH team regularly because they're using our facilities. It's all closely linked to shared spaces in the school before or after school. We have access to the whole school as that makes it easier for the children when we're tra transitioning from OSH to the classroom or vice versa. And it's very familiar. So the children don't feel any fear um, or uneasiness when moving from one area to another. And the staff are often there by them, their side to assist them when they're in those transitional periods as well. You've really got to tap into the nature of what's going to work for the majority of those kids based on the interests that, that they're coming through with. So for instance, if you've got a type of learning activity that might take a child five or ten minutes longer to complete, you make an adjustment around that because the intention is to do the learning, they just might need more time to do that. If you've got a child who's in the gardening club who would like to have a little bit more of a team approach rather than working solo or independent, you make adjustments around that. Some some kids learn best in that way of learning. By building up a children's ability to make decisions and to allow them to have that collaboration and be part of the decision making within your program, you're creating a whole new generation of decision makers. They need to be able to make decisions and that is not something that just comes naturally to everybody. For us, having children make those decisions means that takes some pressure off the staff. If you've got children taking some of that pressure off because they're making their own decisions and they're coming up with the ideas, that makes for a happier and easier place for everybody to be. You will see that at school, if the kids are spending a lot of time playing handball, then that will overflow into Oshk and we will see handball being the main priority for them on an afternoon. So that happens with their learning as well. If they're really working on something at school, then they're loving to be part of that at after school care and we don't struggle with getting children to participate when we're doing those things as well. We just keep reminding ourselves that the children are why we're here. They are, they are the only reason that we do what we do. So that is very important to us. We want the children to know that as well. And we try and teach that while also teaching them the respect for that.